this is a jelly bean plant. Let me show you how I propagate it. Make sure whatever you use to take the cuttings is sterile. This plant has a lot of new growth coming from the center, so I'm cutting off the larger head so it can focus its energy on the little babies. And every one of these heads I'm cutting off will end up being a new plant. I got lucky because most of these already had roots. Don't worry because any leaves that fall off during this process can be propagated into new plants too. Now that I'm done with the cuttings, you can look at all this new growth. Now the plant can focus all its energy on these little babies. Now that these cuttings have dried out overnight, it's time for me to make my homemade succulent soil mix so I can plant them. I'll be using three parts organic compost, two parts natural sand, and one part pea gravel. The amount of pea gravel varies, and sometimes I'll even throw in organic chunks. But this is what I'm using this time. Now that it's mixed well, it's time to fill the pot. The trick is to make sure the soil stays loose enough for the roots to get air. But at the same time, you want it to be packed enough so the plant can stay in there nice and tight. Now I'm removing the bottom sets of leaves so that new roots can grow. Now I'm sure you all know how to do this part is planting them. If you need an explanation, then here it is. You put them in the dirt. Pretty simple. But in all seriousness, it's even complicated just to plant them. There's a lot of tricks that people might not know. For example, spacing. You want to make sure they have plenty of space even once they're fully grown. Otherwise, you end up with an overcrowded pot. You want to make sure that the soil isn't packed too tightly or too loosely. There are many things that I don't even know yet. Looks like I spilled a little bit here, but that's all right. I try to make sure never to waste anything. I think these look really pretty. planted and this is what the other pot looks like absolutely beautiful and once the babies grow up and fill out then we can do the same thing all over again let me know what you thought of this video in the comments and let me know what you want to see next thanks for watching